Hello and welcome back to Song Reaction Analysis with your girl JVB. How are you guys doing today? I actually have a little carpet on here and it doesn't slide as much <laughs> as good. How are you doing today, guys? Uh, I'm just a goofball. My name is Jacqueline Van Bierk. I am a singer, songwriter, music producer and composer, vocal performance coach and I love doing reaction videos for you guys. So thank you for being here also checking out my links in the description below i have a new song out dancing with myself make sure that you check out my spotify itunes if you are on spotify definitely add me follow me and also add my songs to playlist i would so appreciate that and if you're into nfts i have plenty of NFT nfts available um, in the description below check out the links would love to have you on my team and be part of my journey with no further ado Floor Janssen, another Floor Janssen song. Um, she has a side project or had a side project, Northward and uh, Why Love Died is one of the songs you guys recommended. Um, the video is from 2018. Um, it's a hard rock project with Floor Janssen and um, Jorn Vigo Lovestad from Pagan's Mind. So I have not heard that song or the project at all so i'm really excited to check it out if you haven't yet and you like what you hear and see make sure that you definitely hit the subscribe button the like button notification bell so you never miss a post of mine and let's get straight into it Flo is one of those singers who just like makes me smile all the time she makes me so happy it's something about her energy i just love so i'm excited to check out this project and I have to say, Flo Janssen has been so busy doing so many things. I so love it. All right, here we go. You love me, you hate me, would you please decide? We put hatred through the things we didn't say. I guess honesty sometimes really breaks me. Oh, I love this because this is so different from what she normally does. I love her little raspy voice. And by the way, like I just realized when I'm like bouncing, my whole stand is bouncing. So <laughs> I'll try not to bounce as much. Um, oh my God, the grit in her voice. I so love that. I love when she does that. It's like so, um, so rock and roll. She's such a rock and roll queen. Back to here. She's so cute when she looks like that. Cool riff, by the way. You love me, you hate me, would you please decide? We put hatred through the things we didn't say. I guess honesty sometimes really breaks things up. so good it's very rock and roll i love the hook it's super hooky oh my god back to here and the riff is so cool i really love it i love the great energy you know it's just like nice rock and roll energy and her range is just so amazing when she slides up into the high register and just like gives us a little grid oh it's so good
that was a cool part. So I'm, I'm trying to figure out. So this is like an outro hook. That was really cool. I want to hear that again. Um, so interesting. That riff, by the way, is badass. So I have to stop again. What I love about it's that that little break there is so cool because it's a it's an, a, a surprise, right? We love surprises in songwriting. When you hear a song and you don't expect that, that is just awesome. But then also changing the second verse up in songwriting to me that is so need it and add so much to the song because it's something you haven't heard yet but it's still kind of the same but just a little bit different and it, and when she sings the second verse there's so much character in it. i just really love i can really feel her energy i can feel her her personality shining through really telling the story i just love that like she would be a great actress um back to here and I'm not saying she's faking it, but I'm saying she's really good at expressing her feelings and making the words, the emotions come to life, you know? Ugh, I just, I love that. And you can tell she has theatrical background because she's just so engaged and so animated. <laughs> Okay, that was a badass guitar solo. I love that. Wow. Um, 
wow, that, that almost felt like some improv, you know, some really wild, just like going off on it. I, I so love that. I love the sound of the guitar. Of course, it's like a, a Gibson, right? Um, so yeah, <laughs> it just sounds so good, but he's so good. Never heard of the guy. What the hell? Where am I? Uh, but I love the song. There's so much awesome energy in that song. I want to hear that solo one more time. Okay, I really like that. Um, I love the energy. They both have really good chemistry. And the way the video is done, the simplicity of it, it served the song for sure. And I, I just love her energy. And it's funny because even though it was just her and him, it felt so engaging the entire time because he's really interesting to watch. And I love his guitar style, his playing. And her, of course, it's Floor Janssen, right? Floor Gasms left and right because her voice is just like amazing. But I also feel like this specific song is like she has the ability to always like depending on what project she's working on, what kind of song she's doing to really always serve this song and bring like that the the spirit the soul from the song just to bring it to life if that makes any sense i love it i love the energy it's very to me it's very 90s kind of um but that's kind of her style anyway right like and i love how versatile she is i love that she does so many different things and that she can just like that she's not afraid to like even like her, her outfits right like she, she changes it. She looks like this. Then she looks like, th I just love that. Like she couldn't just look like, look like the rock chick that's in the rock band and or like this very theatrical, like, you know, Nightwish kind of style um, with the corset. And like, I love that because it's just like so represents so many facets of her personality. I just absolutely am blown away by the song. The song is really good. It's really well written. I love the structure. At first I was like, I was confused with the, with the second part of the chorus, but now when I, the longer I heard it, I was like, ah, oh, that makes perfect sense. And then I like that, again, it, it's layered really well. It's very hooky, but also like her performance of the song felt just so, that's what it's all about, right? A song has to be, the right singer has to be singing that song because it could be the most amazing song, but if it's the wrong singer, it doesn't, the message may not come across. So I, she does such an amazing job and you can tell how authentic they are, you know? Absolutely love it. Should we do another reaction with them? Because I want to hear more, honestly. Um, I really love their project and I'm assuming that the other song's going to be just as amazing. So thank you for recommending this. I really dig it. Um, in the description below, all the links are there so you can check out the original without me stopping and also my own links obviously to my own music my projects i would so appreciate you guys doing that checking it out it means the world to me having you and i'm also my patreon is up and running so i'm always open to suggestions so if you have like oh i wish you would do this or you would offer that i'm here like Tell me, because I want to know what you guys would like to, to see more of. Or, you know, in Patreon, I want it to be more exclusive, where we can get to know each other more on a personal level versus here on YouTube, which I love, of course. But it, I want to talk to you guys and see you and engage more with you, right? So that's a chance for us to get to know each other better. So in the comments below, let me know about that as well. And you can also email me uh, at jackranby at gmail.com and just 
tell me what's up and what you would like to hear more of and or obviously just join my Patreon and be become part of the fam. With that said, I'm always going to leave you with something positive. Make every day an amazing day and count your blessings always because it's so easy to dismiss all our little accomplishments, right? We always focus on the things we don't have or we want to do. Look at all the things you have done so far, all the things you've overcome so far, the things that you've survived and give yourself credit for that and let that be your inspiration to keep continue living your dreams, to continue visualizing your goals and just like dream big and don't get caught up in, in thinking how and I can, I'm too old, I'm too dumb, I'm not the wrong race, I'm in the wrong place, whatever you, it may be. The possibilities are endless and if you can see it, you can create it, mostly. You know, obviously if you are five foot, you're not gonna be six foot unless you wear big heels. There you go. <laughs> Make it work. I'm going to let you go. I love you guys so much. Thank you for your support, for your love. If you haven't yet, make sure you hit the subscribe button, the like button, the notification bell, and as well as check out my own music. And I love you. And I will see you in the next one. Take care.